Facebook Messenger Privacy Hack. In this video, we will demonstrate a cross-origin bypass attack that affects Facebook Messenger. In the example we share, the code representing the vulnerability is planted in a malicious ad, but the code can be planted anywhere on an external website controlled by the attacker. This particular attack begins when the victim visits a news website where they are greeted by an innocent-looking ad carrying the code. Even if the victim never clicks on the ad, she is infected simply by opening the web page. Now, when the victim opens Facebook Messenger, all of her messages will be sent to the attacker. The victim accesses her Facebook account, opens Messenger, and begins chatting. The computer screen of the second chatter is visible to the right. Susan wants to share private information with Karen. In the meanwhile, as the two chat, the malicious code goes to work. On the left, you can see the HTTP requests sent from the victim's browser. On the right, you can see the chat messages received by the attacker on the bugsec.com domain. We have used bugsec.com as the command and control to show how easy it is to use a legitimate website to carry out the attack. The malicious code is now sending the messages to bugsec's logging page. As you can see, a request with the origin null has been made to the Facebook Messenger domain. Facebook replies with access control allow origin for the origin null. Within the details, you can view the content of the message from Facebook Messenger. This is one example of how a cross-origin bypass attack can be executed. They can also be carried out by injecting malicious code via cross-site scripting into a legitimate website or by using phishing and social engineering techniques to lure victims onto a malicious site. To learn more, email info at bugsec.com or info at